emergency episode 99 of College Football's Peek Around the Corner with your host, Greg Flugar. Pete Thamel, breaking news. It just was released. ESPN, Pete Thamel, sources. Wisconsin has targeted Cincinnati's Luke Fickle to be the school's next head coach. Wow. Before we get into the story, please smash that like button if you like our content. Please subscribe to our ever-growing channel and share the video with your family and friends. We're not wasting any more time. This is gigantic news. Not just because it was Cincinnati's Luke Fickle, an unbelievable successful coach of the Cincinnati Bearcats, but going to the Wisconsin Badgers and being announced by Pete Thamel, who knows this stuff inside and out. He's Mr. Rolodex on agents, athletic directors. Let's get to the short story here. Pete Thamel sources Wisconsin has targeted Cincinnati's Luke Fickle to be the school's next head coach. Let's get right into the article. We're not wasting any time. Wisconsin has targeted Luke Fickle to be the school's next head coach. Sources told ESPN no deal is signed, but there is a strong push by the Badgers to try to land Fickle in the next 48 hours. Fickle led Cincinnati to the college football playoff last season and has gone 57 and 18 in six years there. Fickle's 2021 Bearcats team went 13 and 0 before losing to Alabama in the college football playoff, becoming the first group of five team to reach the college football playoffs. Fickle has strong roots in the Big Ten as he was a longtime assistant coach and coordinator at Ohio State played there. He'd been picky about jobs over the years as Cincinnati rose to the top of the group five, being selective about the Midwestern footprint. Fickle would replace Paul Christ, who was fired in the middle of the season after going 67 and 26 in eight seasons there. He'd been replaced. This is Paul Christ. He'd been replaced by Jim Leonard, who had been the defensive coordinator and considered a candidate for the head coaching job. Fickle's attraction to the Badgers brass along with his record and roots in the league and his ability to build a program. Fickle turned Cincinnati into one of the country's best developmental programs, taking modest recruits and consistently churning out strong teams. Last year, Fickle's Bearcats had nine players picked in the NFL draft, which was third behind only Georgia and LSU. Fickle spent one season as interim coach at the Big Ten going 6-7 in 2011. In the wake of the firing of Jim Tressler at Ohio State, he stayed patient from there, working as the Buckeyes defensive coordinator under Urban Meyer winning the national championship in 2014. This is explosive news because if Pete Thamel is putting it out there on his Twitter feed, this morning, you better believe there is smoke and fire burning. Wisconsin, Luke Fickle, I can only say this. I know this is a college football national YouTube channel. But my goodness, as a Gopher fan, this would be a dagger into the heart of my Gopher heart. A dagger. Luke Fickle to Wisconsin. When Wisconsin Badgers fired Paul Chris, I was in the heavy minority saying it was a good move. You could see the decline of the Wisconsin Badgers football program. Yes, Paul Chris has a good overall record, but the decline was there. You could see it. You could see it in the recruiting. You could see it in the development of the Wisconsin Badgers. Look at that offensive line. Look at the quarterback position. Uh, this is stunning news. If they were able to get, if Wisconsin was able to get Luke Fickle, man, flip the page. Wisconsin going into the future is going to go back to being a high-level football program. Wisconsin Badgers, Luke Fickle. Everyone's been talking about Luke Fickle. He's, he's going to wait for the Ohio State Buckeyes job. Look at Look at uh, Coach Day from the Buckeyes. A lot of heat on him. A lot of heat, but he, they're not going to get rid of him after this year. Cincinnati Bearcats leaving the AAC, going to the Big 12. Does Luke Fickle think Cincinnati can't compete in the Big 12? Or does he just want to get back to the Big 10? Probably so. Probably so. The Big 10 with that huge media money. 
We know recruiting is going to change once that revenue comes rolling in. This direct compensation from the school and conference going to the student athletes. As we have told you here at Peek Around the Corner since episode one, the big time coaches are going to be more and more attractive to the Big Ten and SEC jobs. Luke Fickle to Wisconsin. Breaking news deal hasn't been signed yet, but if Pete Thamel is announcing it, that there could happen. That there are talks. Got to take this serious, man. This is smoke. This is not just smoke. This is a burning fire raging. Wisconsin with Luke Fickle. Go for hard in me. He says, no, please, no, no. Gophers just beat the Badgers for the second year in a row. It's first time since 1993-1994. Say it ain't so, Pete Thamel. Say it ain't so. McIntosh is going to pull this off. He's going to grab Luke Fickle from Cincinnati. Stick with us here at Peek Around the Corner. Put down your comments. Put down your thoughts in the comments section below. If you're a Big Ten fan, are you terrified of Wisconsin getting Luke Fickle? You should be. You should be. Wow. Until next time, from Peek Around the Corner here in the Emergency Episode 99. Until next time, from all of us here to all of you, please you all take care of each other. Thank you so very much.